I mean, thy kingdom come, thou will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us of our debts as we forgive our debt to us. Lead us not into temptation. Hello everyone, welcome back to another dun, 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 dun. Wait, the lighting is low on Facebook. It's high though. Welcome back to another predestined predestined kingdom ministries videos. Go Jesus! <laughs> Alright guys, I'm Kenithia J or Kenithia and so um I already prayed. The Lord had me praying um, at the beginning of this call. I actually hit. I was trying to turn up the volume, um, or that's better if you do it like that. But yeah, so I was trying to turn up the volume for Instagram, and then it just started recording. So then I had to start recording. <laughs> God is so good, family. I'm excited. Can you tell? I'm so excited. Like, I just woke up, like, excited, <laughs> expectant, excited. So, I pray I stay like this all day, right? I'm going to fight for it. So, okay. So, the first thing the Lord wanted me to say was, um, you want me to reference back to the number six? If you're seeing the number six, one of the things the Lord is also trying to show you is that he chose you to be prophetic. You are prophetic, which means you are aligned spiritually and naturally with God. And he uses you and he uses you as a vessel to speak to different people for him. That's what a prophet is. Somebody who could see in the spirit. Somebody who God doesn't hide himself from so so he so they can relay messages like sometimes he, he still hides himself, but very seldom. That normally is a test. But anyway, you are prophetic. If you're saying the number six, you are prophetic, okay? God is using using you spiritually to speak to his people. So that is what the Lord was showing me this morning. I had somebody tell me, okay, so <laughs> somebody ordered a gift for my daughter and they had it sent to the house, right? And she knew. I I've been telling a lot of people, my daughter is prophetic since she was two years old. She, the Lord has been, she confirmed my husband at two years old. Like she knew. Like, she been telling me, Mommy, you gonna go back to this person. And Lord and behold, Father God confirmed that. She told me I was gonna have twins. I didn't believe her. And God told me, okay, go buy them clothes for the... Like, you know, so... I'm saying all of this to say, when she got the gift that was delivered to the house, the first thing she said when they rung the door was, was Mommy, that's my surprise gift, right? And so... I told the person, and the person said, she not prophetic, she just smart. And so, this morning, the Lord, like, he was just confirming, like, no, you are prophetic. No, your daughter is prophetic. No, there's no such thing as just being that smart. Like, you got smart, you got God's wisdom, God's, <laughs> God's wisdom, knowledge, and understanding. You got earthly being smart, which means, um... I don't know how to explain that. Universal smart. <laughs> universe. That's when you just listening to the universe and not God. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Universal smart. <laughs> I'm sorry. I cracked myself up, y'all. <laughs> but anyway, if you're seeing the number, you are prophetic. Okay. <laughs> if you're seeing the number six, congratulations. You are prophetic. So, Let's get into this word. 
Today's scripture will be from Matthew 6, verse 33. But seek first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all these things shall be added unto you. Okay. The Lord was showing me a lot of y'all are seeking the prophets versus him. Now this is a two-parter to this prophetic video today. One, yes, God called you to be a prophet. But two, you, you got to seek God first. Okay, don't seek after the prophets. You have to seek after the Lord. And then the Lord, if you can't get the message he's personally giving you, he will send a prophet to confirm whatever he's trying to tell you or whatever the enemy is trying to stop. So, more of the story is, even though you have prophets, don't seek after the prophets. Seek after Father God. The Lord God says, look to him for a prophetic word. Look to him for everything. Seek ye first the kingdom of God. Like, don't be so obsessed over this person because this person can prophesy to you. Like, Father God is saying, you still got to seek him in order for him to give the prophet the word. Because we don't get nothing unless the Lord tell us to. And if we start even saying the wrong thing, he snatches his word away from our mouth. So we have to go and do what God say do. But seek ye the kingdom of God. Like he don't seek after the prophet for the word. Seek after the Lord for the word and then let him bring you that prophet. Okay. So that's the word of today. Seek after the Lord and not a prophetic word. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Shalom. I love y'all so much.